For those who have been frustrated with this error, what you do is you go to Power Supply Settings, Functions Available in Standby Mode, and turn off your Connect to the Internet. For some reason, uh, since the latest firmware um, update, which was the 1.52, uh, when the PlayStation 4 powers down, it's been powering down your, um, your Wi-Fi and it won't restart. So uh, what we've done, of course, is, is uh, turn that off, uh, and then we power down the PlayStation 4. We went the extra little bit and uh, like uh, pulled the plug from it and let it sit for about a minute. Uh, just to make sure I'll give it a hard reset. Turned it back on and as you will see as we get into uh, testing internet connection everything worked this time perfectly fine. So we didn't get the failed to obtain an um, IP address uh, and so everything's working great. Um, another um, solve for this that somebody had done, this didn't help us, was to, um, they've been finding that this happens if you have like a regular DVD or Blu-ray movie inside the PlayStation 4. Um, that wasn't our issue, but just in case this doesn't work for you, maybe that will work for you. Anyway, uh, thanks a lot for watching our video. I hope this helped. Uh, if it did or didn't, please comment because uh, people are having this issue and we like to get to the bottom of it. Um, please like, share, uh, favorite, whatever this video. Um, uh, we've been uh, Ryan has started his another channel. Uh, please check that out um, if you get a chance. Uh, that's why we've been we've been kind of working on stuff like that lately. Like uh, we're both starting individual channels as well as going to continue with this one. Um, but um, that's why we haven't had a video out lately. Anyway, thank you very much for your time. Have a good day.